Access all areas. What's good, twin? What's good, Jasmine? It's your boy, Charlie Sloth, the people's prince, the best-looking fat guy in the universe. And I'm here to tell you about your challenge for Access All Areas. This year, Twin and Yasmin will be producers of the Charlie Sloth Show. That's right. You're going to take it in turns to see who is the superior producer out of the both of you. Do you accept the challenge? So I feel confident I can do this. Right. I'm in. Well, I have no words because actions... Speak louder than words. Easy. Right work. Twin Bean has got three main tasks. Coming up with some creative ideas, uh, thinking about how they'll work on social media, picking a track and scheduling it. Thirdly, the most important thing really is on-air production, because even if all else fails, you still have to deliver a show. Features and talking points are important for shows. They help the shows progress, they help it have a hook. First thing you want to see Twin B and, and Yasmin doing is research, looking at Twitter, maybe reading newspapers, watching television to see what people are talking about. Other people might be doing the same thing. How are we going to make it bespoke to one extra radio one? We're going to find a woman for Charlie on the social networks in half an hour. The only thing down on paper I've got is an actual picture of Charlie Sloth. Essentially, you want to find a love interest for Charlie Sloth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes! What about Charlie and his chocolate factory? So you go into the chocolate factory to find an old classic. That is a talking point and social networks done in one. Music knowledge is pretty much fundamental to the job here at Radio 11 Extra. You need to be able to live and breathe it. Uh, Twin B and Yasmin do pride themselves on their musical knowledge. Uh, so today I expect to see some top selections. You want a sexy, romantic kind of track? Yeah, so slow it down a bit. But I also need some music when Charlie's talking, so I need a bed. Okay, so copy it. Copy it. Then we're going to put it into the schedule. Yes. Yasmin Free Play, That's Love Don't Cost But my body. R. Kelly, Bump and Grind. Find your love, yeah? Yeah. Find your love. Bang. There you go. Yeah. That's by Drake. Then go to the schedule. Do you want to leave some sort of note so the presenter knows why? No, no, because I will communicate. He's the pilot and I'm the guy on the side. Yeah. The same to him. Fly. Okay. Because this is what I think makes a great presenter-producer relationship is that I don't rely on the notes to tell him. Mm -hmm. I will. Job done. Let's go and handle the voice on the stick. The challenge for Twin B and Yasmin today is to produce Charlie Sloth. They have 30 minutes each in which to do that. I expect to see some really good creative ideas from Twin B and Yasmin. Um, hopefully they'll understand what the audience want and what they like. It's all very well having a great idea, but you need to convince your presenter it's a great idea. She wins Charlie Sloth, BBC Radio, one extra. Charlie, here's your so what am I doing? Do you want to put some, a bed on if you're going to have a chat or are you going to get into some music? Oh, sorry boss. Little bit of Angel, BBC Radio 1 Extra, this is us! Obviously you know that the, the video for this is out. Is there any information on it? No. And my new producer for half an hour, Yasmin Evans from 1 Extra Breakfast, has just given me a brand new feature which is actually quite sick. It's called Charlie's Chocolate Factory. So we're about to take it smoother. So whatever you're doing right now, just stop. Take your shoes off. If your feet don't smell. And just kick back and relax. My mind's telling me no, but my body, my body's telling me yes. yes. Yeah, you're feeling it. He's feeling it. Can you sort out the news, please? <laughs> Don't mess with the news. <laughs> I haven't had enough time to do what I wanted. She's been really, really good. Yeah, I'll definitely get her back. Brilliant. Yasmin was on air for half an hour and just basically managed to play music and then started a talking point but didn't have any time to wrap it up. Charlie in the Chocolate Factory, smooth, talking. It's dreadful. Yo! What's happening? Yeah? Yes, I am. I was like this, so entertained. Oh, you were sick, bro. Bruv, it was sick. Oh, you're the I was laughing. I was dancing, bro. So, what are we doing now, twin? So, you play a record, and yeah. while the record is on, yeah. I'll explain it. You're so good, bro. Like, I can relate to you being popular with the ladies, bro. I'm thinking to ask the audience why they think they suit you on Twitter. They suit me. Yeah, if they suit you, and why. Yes, it is Charlie Sloth, BBC Radio One Extra. What makes you, yes you, think that you could be my perfect Valentine's? Get involved in the show right now. 
88811 on the text line at 1 extra 1 X T R A. Twin, is this really a good talking point? I think I'm sounding a bit sleazy because, like. No, not really. It's just it's an interactive. Interactive. It's just, I'm not really looking for a date. You lead. Take it where you want to take it, bro. Okay. Loads of people want to take me out on a date, apparently. Um, Sophie said, Charlie, I can cook. Try to be my Valentine. P.S. I'm ginger and I know you like ginger girls. Oh, ooh, love that. You played that oh, one. Play this one. No, the, day, the moment I asked you to play. What, what was that? The Damien Marley one. What happened there? What? Charlie has just played the same song twice in a row. I can hardly deal with producers on the best of days. Dealing with them all at once, like 100 of them in my studio, is a bit leave it because I can't lie. First, I thought Twin started strongly, but he just was massaging Charlie's ego, and Charlie's ego is big enough. How do you feel Twin and Yasmin done today? If I'm honest with you, not very well at all. It just felt like turn up, see how it goes, and roll with the punches. I think Yasmin actually did treat it as if she yeah, was a producer. She was more serious. She, she took on that role. She wasn't as creative as Twin. Mm. What I did like about Twin was the fact that he was very encouraging, which I feel was great for a presenter. Me being a boss, I have to make this decision. There can only be one. Twin B. Obviously, I'm not too happy that I lost. Don't ever go up against Twin B in anything, because you'll lose, because everyone feel sorry for him. It's really motivating, man. It really is. It kind of enabled me to understand how important a producer is. Making the presenter feel motivated, informed. Um, the atmosphere in the studio. You know, how important it is for a producer to actually be there, to be honest. Charlie said under his breath about it being the best half an hour of radio. <laughs> and you know what that made me